know, you probably don't want Dippin' Dots. It's your birthday, <laughs> not mine. All right, hello friends. So, uh, I am currently in Lexington. I am about to go get my hair done, which I'm excited about. I have zero concept of what I want her to actually do, so I'm just gonna walk in there and be like, this is your job, you're an artist with hair, do what you want with it. So, I don't wanna like cut too much because it finally just started to grow after not adjusting to the Florida water super well, because it's gross. Um, so I'm not gonna cut it too much, but I'm just gonna have her put some highlights, some color in there, do whatever she wants. So, yeah, I'm excited. And then Jack tonight, I'm in Lexington because Jack is taking me out for my birthday dinner, which is really fun. So I might vlog a little bit of the day um, of us just hanging out together and show you guys my new hair and all that jazz. Yeah, so I don't know what we're gonna get into today, but I'm excited and I'm staying up in Lexington tonight and then um, I'm going to Georgetown and I'm gonna hang out with my friends from school so I'm super excited to see them so it's gonna be a fun little weekend so I thought I would take you guys along um, but yeah I'll see you guys again soon with some new hair <laughs> okay I just got my hair done so she trimmed it just a little so I didn't I didn't like cut the length off which is good and then she just put like a little bit of Balayage, balayage, I don't know how you say that word. Highlights in, so I got a little bit of dimension. Some fun, little bit of like ashy blonde color. Ah, I love it. Mm, mm, mm. I'm excited, so yay. Thanks to Chelsea, which is awesome. But yeah, so I just drove to Jack's house. I'm here now, I'm gonna get out and go hang out with him for the day. Yay. <laughs> They're actual bees. That was a huge bee, but not a motorcycle. The other one was an actual one. Yeah. Thank you. Where are we going? We're going to Wild Figs, which I only know of because I have a coworker oh, yeah. at my breakfast cafe come see me. <laughs> breakfast um, cafe. That sells wholesale coffee there. So shout out to Michael. Yeah. Um, if you're in the Lexington area, go buy his coffee. Um, but we're Mine gonna go coffee. there. It's like a it's a coffee shop and a bookstore. I've never been. I've never been. And we're super pumped. And I'm about to play Angelina. Um, Angelina. Because oh, because I'm straight Italian and. So, the majority of music that Jack and I listen to. Well, we have a wide variety. We really like music. Lots but. Of music. One of our most common occurrences is definitely just like old, like jazz, but we really love just straight up Italian people from that area. Oh, for sure. Just because she is a nice Angelina. Can you put these in your lap because my elbow's got to keep hitting it if I... Gotcha. I drive stick. Super cool. <laughs> I'm still kind of obsessed with the fact that I actually run that. He feels a lot cooler than everyone else because he drives a stick shift, which I don't disagree with. I think it is really cool. Is that so maybe a little prideful? <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. Deeper your Benny. I adore you. This song gets... Insane. It really does. It's so good. I live for you. And it's kind of a new pickup. Because me, my brother, my twin brother, you all have to meet him soon. Oh yeah, and, that'd be uh, fun. And my mom and dad were playing a, an Italian card game called Scopa. And Will and I always put on Italian music in the background just to kind of, I don't know, conjure up the feeling of Italy. And, uh, <laughs> the whole life. Yeah. <laughs> and Angelina came on and I've never looked back. <laughs> we literally just drive around and listen to this. This is just like casual. Oh mama, zumba, zumba, baka. Here we go. Yeah, this is Sarah and I 99% of the time in the car. It's true. It's either that or some nice folk music, obscure mm -hmm. folk music you all have never heard of. Yeah. Or, uh, or... <laughs> 
Amine. Incredibly, <laughs> incredibly ratchet Amine. <laughs> so, we, Wide variety we have in the car. We love like discovering it. new music yeah. for sure. That's definitely a, yeah. a thing that we love to do. Um, but today's an Italian day because we're going to Giuseppe's. Yeah. So here's what there was two days ago. Mm -hmm. Two days ago. Uh, and we've always had this little sentimental restaurant experience at Giuseppe's. And, so uh, good. Pretty sure it was the restaurant we went to right before I went to London for. Mm -hmm. for you weren't even dating then. Let's stay. That's insane. But we had this. We had. Um, I, we were I put talking. fake champagne in that <laughs> in the uh, I in the trunk in these little plastic like champagne cups glasses <laughs> and. Uh, <laughs> And we, we popped them open after the after the dinner and we sat in our car and so really good memories with that. Yeah. For sure. And then Oh and there was that right Louis there. Armstrong that yeah. same night, wasn't there? I think this I think he was wasn't actually there. Was it my birthday this time last year that we went to? Yes. Yeah. You were wearing a yellow dress. things where my sister um, she whenever whenever I was in the seventh grade she had Burkitt's lymphoma which is a kind of cancer and she was always whenever she was home recovering um, which she's completely cured now which is awesome ten years shout out to Ellie yeah Hi, ten Ellie, years. she we went to New you. Orleans uh, to celebrate a couple months ago yeah but we always would like hang around the house and Will and I wouldn't actually get mad at her for watching what she wanted to watch on the TV which was a miracle in itself and America's Next Top Model was always on and girls were bald all the time <laughs> and I've always thought that Sarah is like a freaking supermodel of a G and uh, <laughs> so um, this is the official announcement I'm shaving my head <laughs> <laughs> okay I just learned the other day that manual cars don't have like a parking like yeah, one of these. So whenever I pulled up the the manual, I break, thought he was joking. She, she was always like, "Okay, what are you doing, Jack?" Like uh, I literally, I was like, "I mean, because my dad pretty much always puts his parking brake on when he parks. Like it's not necessary, but he just kind of always does it." Right. And so I was stud. like, <laughs> "So I was like, oh, I was like, did you do you always put your parking brake up?" And he was like, "Yeah, that's how you park a park. manual car." I was like, "Excuse me, what? You literally just put it in neutral and then put on the parking brake." Yeah. That blew my mind. Did yeah, anyone I mean, else know that? Is that like a common thing? I don't think many people know a lot about manual. That's true. I didn't know it was anything so about it. so much cooler than anyone. <laughs> but yeah, I, I mean, what can I say? <laughs> Alrighty. I'll show you guys a little bit of it when we get in there. Peace. Peace. We just got here. Here's some cool art. Looks like a little red riding hood. <laughs> Carrying something. Ah. Oh. I got scared. He need to play a trick on me, but I thought he actually hit his head. Hey, this looks cute. Come looks on fun. in. Welcome to Bob's. <laughs> you guys literally have a we'll chai chai latte. Like black panther. And I think she's Jack got um. Almond cookie. Yeah, almond cookie green tea, and it literally smells incredible. Mm. And I got the chai chai latte. I'm so excited. <laughs> He's taking notes on his book. Oh. <laughs> She's so fun. I like this little spot. I know. It's nice and quiet. We're just sitting here reading. She got the Black Panther inspired chai tea. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know. So excited. Really, is my go-to. I'm obsessed with Black Panther. So, let's mix. <laughs> so I'm reading the book Thief right now. Tell me if you've read it and if it changed your life like it did Jax. I'm excited to read it. 
Okay, so we really loved that coffee shop. It was super awesome, but we just got back. We have very little time to change and get ready. And then we are heading off to dinner. All right, we had our costume change. Look at him, we're shoot! Looking, we're looking at least semi-presentable. <laughs> Semi Gosh, that new hair, I'm losing my mind, guys. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably annoying her at this point with the compliments, but. Never annoyed. Over, overflowing. <laughs> Hot day. So we're going to Giuseppe. So we're going to Giuseppe. <laughs> I'm super excited. Super pumped. I look very pale in this light. <laughs> I needed some lipstick, but I didn't prepare or bring any. So no, that's I, think, okay. I think you're working it. This ensemble is, Jack is a fan. Thanks, babe. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> Do what I can. We're currently so, stuck in a little bit of traffic. Yeah, and we have eight minutes, minutes now <laughs> to get there, and we are so. probably about five miles away, which sounds like we could make it, but... This is like the busiest part of Lexington yeah. that we're trying to get on to. And little town Jack still doesn't understand getting on the road early to get ahead of traffic. Yeah, Maybe we're not it, used to it. <laughs> it's like showing the back of my car being kind of dirty. Okay. Wow. <laughs> A disgrace. There? You got my mixed nuts. My <laughs> mixed nuts and protein bars with books. That's basically Jack in a nutshell. Like that could not be a more perfect. <laughs> Literally, that is him. Protein bars and books. Oh, traffic. We're gonna delay. <laughs> Moving. We are moving. I don't bust it twice just because you. Bro, you gotta yield. Do you remember the last time? <laughs> I just remember, I forgot about this. Do you remember the last time we were here and on the receipt you wrote first date went well? <laughs> <laughs> that was it, wasn't it? <laughs> and I was so embarrassed. I don't know where I was like, just get the first date. <laughs> like, we've literally been dating each other for 10 years. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh my I love gosh, like that's hysterical. Like that. uh, I don't know I why I, I got so stressed out. I was like, she's gonna yeah. go on a first date. This is so weird. But I'm pretty sure I dotted my eye with a heart too. So she yes, probably... I believe. She's probably like, that one's not gonna last. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll, I'll see you guys when we get there. Yeah, we're one minute late already. One minute late already. Doing great. We will update you all while we're eating bread or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't wait. Can't wait. <laughs> I'm just carbs. not even gonna think about it. Celebrating Sarah's birthday. Don't think Eat about it, Jack. all the carbs you want. And we're gonna hit up some friggin' ice cream after, too. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a good day. Good day. She's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her. Uh. <laughs> You're cute. <laughs> okay, that's it from us. Peace! <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're here. We made it 10 minutes late. We got ranchi, mm -hmm. uh, which is uh, fried ricotta yes. in ball form. Yes. <laughs> Risotto. Risotto. Now there we go. I was like, that's cheese. Yeah, it has cheese in it. Yeah. That's a nice restaurant. Yummy, yummy. This is the first time we've been on this side of the restaurant. I know. There's a group of old ladies that are screaming. <laughs> it's so loud. She looks a lot better than I do, so you do want to flip and talk to them yourself. I'm yes. afraid Brandon's gonna walk over here. Hold <laughs> on. I just oh god. I just don't like to film in inappropriate settings, and I thought this was an inappropriate setting. But yeah, that's it. So we're here. We made it. Yeah. Super happy. Just Birthday dinner. Convinces. 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 Now. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Okay, so <laughs> we just left and it was delicious. So good. Thank you. No problem. Happy birthday. Thanks. And uh, we had the best waiter ever. He Jordan. was wonderful. Well, I heard there was another waiter at like some first watch breakfast cafe that was pretty sick. But yes, best waiter ever for sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just kidding. I pick you any day. Um, but <laughs> Jack, I think we told this story on the way there where you wrote it was the... You wrote it was the first day. Well, he did it again, but we, he forgot that he had told Jordan at the 
Sorry, I would totally open the door for you. But, <laughs> but we're trapped in some bushes over here. Yeah, good parking job from Jack. <laughs> we didn't have many options. Yeah, true. Um, but Jack, he asked if we had been there before. Jack was like, oh yeah, we've been here. But then so he was riding on the receipt and he's like, dear Jordan, it was our first date. I think she's really gonna like me. And I was like, Jack, you told him we had been here before. And he was like, oh shoot. And so <laughs> then like, we were just like, so he like literally just like line marked it off and then was like, um, what did you write after that? It was I something said, uh, like, you're the man, around. stick around so that if we come around again, we can ask can for you as a story. And <laughs> then at the bottom, he was like, P.S. I always write the first day thing when we're here, but I forgot that I told you that we had come here. But then Jack just went like over the top. <laughs> this is why I love you so much. It just is hilarious. So he literally already gave him like well over a tip that he like is like a normal yeah. thing. And then he wrote him like 15 receipt pages of letters <laughs> and he gave him. <laughs> well first Jack pulled a fortune a fortune from a fortune cookie it was a really good one out of his wallet and set it in the little like yeah. um, it said, uh, bill it said better to be an optimist and be wrong than a pessimist and be right there we go so that's good good yeah. truth I for Jordan Jordan deep <laughs> and then, <laughs> Jack had a gift card for the movie theaters. I had like, what'd you say, like 20 bucks on it? What? There's a Dippin' Dots here? <laughs> In the mall, I think. Uh, Is it still open? I don't know. You probably don't want Dippin' Dots. It's your birthday, <laughs> not mine. Um, <laughs> um, sorry, sorry. So what'd you ask? I didn't ask anything. Oh, never mind. Keep, keep <laughs> explaining. Um... So then Jack literally gives Jordan this like $20 movie ticket <laughs> gift card and then writes on another receipt page and was like, hey, because Jack was going with the gift card. I was like, you have to explain this. Like, this He's like, what no is sense. that? And so Jack literally left a gift card and was like, this has, what did he say? Like it has $20 on it. Um, uh, this has $20 on it. Uh, if you have not if you haven't seen The Quiet Place, you should go see it. Super good. Uh, oh, I said at any Carmike. <laughs> at any Carmike I've never cinema been to Carmike movie. cinemas before. <laughs> it was really funny. So, he now has $20 worth of Carmike Cinema's movie money. Yeah, he does. And he has a decent tip. And a good fortune. What the? Ooh. Get over the hump. <laughs> Off road. <laughs> um, oh, just said you treat us so well. <laughs> treat us so well. But Jordan Loki was awesome. Jordan, if yeah, you're a Jordan YouTube Moore. fan and you like Disney, <laughs> bro, excellent work. Um, he was so He was nice. probably fangirling about slightly. Probably. Here. He was like, oh my God, Sarah Beth on my tail. He didn't really seem like the uh, slightly Sarah Beth type. <laughs> was um, But he was so nice. And if you yeah. ever go to Giuseppe's, he has a really long beard and his name is Jordan. Well, everybody in there. <laughs> Even though really a lot of people there have long beards. <laughs> um, well, Jordan was the man, seriously. That was so fun. Um, you're the man. You <laughs> gave him like so much stuff. Well, I ever since I became a server, and, and that's kind of like the servant mentality, there's this girl who comes in to first watch all the time that works at a steakhouse downtown, leaves me huge tips, and she's just like, I'm a server downtown, honey, I know what it's like. Yeah. And so it's like, well, I freaking feel like I have to do the same thing because us servers, man, if any of you all served before or waited before, it's the grind. <laughs> Grinding um, out there. And, uh, and it's just, it is just like a cool way to serve people. Like, for sure. Because they're literally waiting on you, and it's like, yeah. you're getting paid, what, like $2 an yeah. hour? Yeah. And, I don't know. Yeah, he deserved that. He did really, really well. Yeah, he was awesome. That was fun. Yeah, that was super hey. fun. No problem. And now we're thinking about ice cream. Mm -hmm. Guys, this isn't a live feed, but what should we do? <laughs> Comment down below. <laughs> Let me know. Link in the bio. Um, <laughs> we could live feed on Instagram. Like, oh, where do that'd we go? Be fun. That would be actually kind of fun. Okay, we might do that. Okay. Stay tuned. <laughs> You'll see it. <laughs> but just not right now. We have a graders in Chevy Chase. No freaking way. Yeah. I don't know how far away it is from here, but well, it's Lexington, so it can't be too far. How far it is. You want to get graders? Sure. Well, we don't have to live feed now if we know what we're doing. Maybe we'll live feed while we're eating ice cream. Well, that's 
that's good. Hey, it's your call. You're the. We could do it Instagram just in the car. Yeah. yeah. We could. We could. We could present two options. Yeah. Like, should we go to Graders or sit next to a dumpster? And then maybe people will just like automatically pick what we want to do. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Thanks, guys, for helping. You know. That idea. Oh, I have no <laughs> clue what you're doing. Foam wars? Indoor Nerf wars with a Z? <laughs> I'm in there, like swimwear. Foam wars. Do you think, wait, the foam refers to the it's foam a nerf. bullet. Not yeah, like not having like a, a Nerf war in foam. In foam. I don't think Which so. might be something to look into if you're looking for a business plan. <laughs> Where did we come to? <clears throat> We came to the greatest. Mmm. Let's see what you did there. <laughs> all time. <laughs> Great. Ice cream meets fun. <laughs> I got black raspberry chip. It's literally the best. But she gave me so much of it. I asked for one scoop. They gave out some Disney scoops here where it's like, can I get one scoop please? And it's like 10 ounces of ice cream. But it's so good. But I can't finish all of it. I asked for a kitty scoop. Yeah. I got just that. I would have asked for a kitty scoop too if I saw how much a single scoop was before. Oh well. Yeah, I'm full. Me too. Was full so now we're heading out and we're going to do something else. Yeah. D I N O. And we're watching it completely legally. <laughs> completely. Completely legally. And so she's never seen it, and she's in for a great movie. I loved it as a kid. I'm so excited. Yeah. And you're going to get to see the That's Iguanodon crazy. in action. Yay! The Iguanodon. Can't work. <laughs> I let y'all know how I feel about it. Woo! So pumped. There he is. There he is. My baby. <laughs> Definitely not our dino. <laughs> Babe, how'd you like dinosaur? I've seen it before, and it was incredible this time, too. Just emotionally rich. <laughs> emotionally rich. Yeah. I agree. Um, it was really good. It was really emotional. And let me just tell you, those riders are some savages. No spoilers, but let's just say they're not scared of killing off characters. Yeah. They're, I mean, I was kind of celebrating, honestly, but... Back in the day, I mean, that's why I'm such a stud, I think, is because that uh, that movie didn't spare my feelings. Like, I'm not true. soft. Right? <laughs> it's true. I was impressed. I'm soft. <laughs> He's emotional. Um... But yeah, it was so good. We had the best day ever. It was the best day. She makes life fun. Mm -hmm. Captain Hummish are also very good too. It's Sriracha Hummus. So. Sriracha. Sriracha. Mm hmm. Sriracha. Right mm -hmm. back at Java. But that's it for my. We had a best long day. Best day ever. She's best the bomb. Best day ever. Love her new hair. Thanks. <laughs> Love you. Peace out, fellas and ladies. <laughs>